You've grown up around snooker all your life. You're a snooker coach. You have your own uh, snooker shop as yeah. well. You know, you just absolutely love the game, don't you? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I started on the women's circuit fairly late, 2016. And then once I got hooked onto that, I knew I could get up high, uh, but you need your own table for that. So, so I devised a plan to, to get a shop and, and get a place with my own table. So yeah, I'm, I'm able to get a lot of practicing. I love practicing. And then I'm also got able to get an income from it by um, doing snooker coaching, which I love. Is this an experience, you know, you, you want to, uh, you know, come back to the shootouts again? It's obviously a great platform for the female players. Yeah. Um, you know, how, how do you make of it as an event? Yeah, I mean, I love the shootout format um, and I think it's fantastic that us women get the chance to play um, in televised events because we need all the exposure we can get. So whether it's me next year or another two women, I'd be happy. Obviously, I'd love it to be me because I, I do um, love trying to perform on in big occasions. So, uh, yeah, any opportunities for the women is good. The women's game is growing all the time. Uh, where do you think it's at at the moment in terms of its current trajectory? Yeah, well, from when I started in 2016, prize money wasn't very big. There wasn't travelling about much, it was just UK and then it's just got grown and grown and grown. We've gone worldwide with events, um, the prize money is getting better, uh, we're getting more people watching, wanting to see us women play uh, and we're obviously getting more players playing but we do really need more women and girls picking up a cue so if, if some girls watch that on TV and thought oh girls can play then hopefully um, they're going to pick up a cue and give it a go. Is that something in your capacity as a coach that you uh, would take a lot of pride in as well in terms of trying to get that next generation of girls into the game? Yeah, I'm keeping to try on asking um, people how, how we can get more girls playing. Um, it's a tough one because, you know, with clubs shut as well with now, but the tables are usually in clubs and, you know, it's more men, social clubs. They might take the boys in there, but is it girls don't generally go and play there. So we need to do something to get more girls into it. Um, and that's something that I aspire to do is get, get more women playing and girls and um, increase the exposure of the women's game. Thanks for your time, Rebecca. Thank you.